My drawer. Yep. That's it, yeah. And drawer. Yep. Yep. That's it. Good. Yep. That's it. And then just do one more that way. Yep. And then you're just going to finish at the walk once you come around the cone. Yep. And just, yeah, just the walk. That's right. So now just bring him into you here. Just bring him into you at the walk. Just go, come in, bud. Good boy. All right. Good. Now, now you're just going to play some friendly game with him. Because I'm videoing you. Yep. So now you're just going to rub him with a stick and... Yep, just back him up a little bit. Good, very nice. Yeah. So friendly game with the stick and string. So just rub him. Rub him with the stick first. There you go. Good boy. So you want to go now, does he understand that I'm just playing the friendly game with my stick and string? Good. Great. <coughs> yep, so you want to show that you can play it in all zones. Yep. And just rub him with a stick and, yep. Don't jiggle that rope too much, he'll back up. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Very good. Yep. Very nice. And then you might just go around the other side. Yeah. I can see you've been doing lots of new friendly game. It's good. It's looking really good. Great. Yeah. Good. Very nice. Then you might whiz it above your head a little bit, play a little helicopter. Hey. Yep. Very nice. Good. Alrighty. Now you just got to massage his legs. That's a nice easy one. Yep, so yeah, just... Oh yeah, he says, I've got itchy spots down there. Do I pick him up? Yeah, if he wants to, if he offers to, if you, you're not for to pick him up nice and lightly, yeah. Sure. Just think about where his weight is, on. if it's on that leg, you're probably going to find it harder. <laughs> yeah, that's it, keep assisting. There we go. That's it. That's alright. Just continue rubbing the rest of the legs. <laughs> Good. Yeah, let's rub the other one. He can chew on his lead rope. Yep. So just Use the hock and use some steady pressure. Yeah, good. There you go. And rub his leg while he's up there. Yay. Good boy. There we go. <laughs> there you go. And see if you can pick up the last front leg. So give it a little massage. and There you go. Cool. That's it. Alrighty. So now you can play a little bit with a yo-yo game or something while you're there. And we'll look at playing some touch-it with his feet. So we're going to kind of send him out and around to the obstacles. and Yep. Good. Yep. That's it. Yep, get going. Yep. That's it. Good. Yeah, then send him around to a few things after you draw him in. Yep. Good boy. So up to about five minutes. Cool. Yep, very nice. So go and play a bit of touch it and 
Hey. Yeah, start with the barrel. That's probably a good one, just with the nose. Yeah. Just relax. Ooh, a barrel. A barrel. Good. Yeah, drive his hind a little bit. Just slightly, yeah. There you go. Yep. You even do some changes of direction. Yep. Yeah. Oh, let him let him look at the tarp. That's cool. <laughs> That's what he wants to look at. <laughs> Good. See if you can get him to put his feet on it. Very nice. Okay, yep. That's it, and draw him to you. Yep. That's great, and send him up to the trot. And see so if you can play with drawing him into you at the trot. Smooch, smooch, smooch. Oop. <laughs> That's alright, just let him stop there. You make it look like you did that on, accident, on, on purpose. <laughs> So move away from the barrel a little bit, yeah. Yep, and then see if you can throw him in. Hey, very nice. Good, yay. Good, give him a rub. That's nice. Yay. Good boy, Ziggy. So why don't you play a little bit with some hindquarter and forequarter yields at, while you're there. Yep. So you can even play with your porcupine game. That might be a good thing to do. Just with a stick and just put the stick on his hindquarter. Use your steady pressure and just move, ask him to move his hind over. <coughs> yep, so, yep, steady pressure. Yeah. So don't tap him, just steady. So keep the stick on him. So you're going to porcupine his hind around. Yeah, just like that. Good, yeah, that's it. And rub him. Good. Great. Then you're going to do the other side. Sit. Yeah, walk towards his hind. Good, very nice. Yep, very nice. Good, rub him. Okay. So go over to the, um, play a bit more with your circling and see if you can kind of wander over to that hay and see if you'll step over that and then maybe onto that pedestal. Yep, so you're up to nine minutes, so you've got about a minute. <laughs> Just go up a bit closer to it so you can help him. Yep. That's it. <laughs> Disengage him. Yep. That's it. Yeah, and see if you can send him back over it. And then while you're there, walk over to that pedestal. Yep. That's it. Just keep walking. See if you can go stand up on the pedestal a little bit. Yep, and then go and ask him to stick his feet up on it. That's it. See if you can draw him a little bit with that rope. Just kind of put a bit of... There you go. Hey, Good. Yep. There you go. Good. And then stop there. Yay. Yep. That's it. He can just stand there with one foot. 